What's up, Wayne Baron here with darkfix.net and we are inside of Adobe Edge Animate and what we're going to be doing here is the following. Just a simple animation, but I mean it's it's pretty cool. Uh, you can have this inside of uh, like a game or something. Um, you can have these like added. Uh, let's say for an example, um, you can uh, add them in and have different ones on your stage and then they can be doing this right here in uniform and so forth. I mean, it can add a really pretty cool effect to your project. So anyway, let's go ahead and jump into it. Let's come over here and create a new composition. And we're just going to add in, hold down shift key and draw a circle. Put it on the center. And this is a little bit bigger than my original one, but it doesn't really matter what size it is for this lesson. So, okay, with this chosen, we're going to come over here to our corners. And we're going to choose our eighth corner. Actually, we can actually do our four corner. So, let's go ahead and double click on our pen tool. And then we're going to come down here and we're going to choose our grid. And then we're going to choose 30. That way we can actually jump onto our uh, frames as small as possible for each one of them. So, then let's come over here and do zero. And then jump to the next one, zero, next one, zero, and then the next one, zero. Okay, let's drag it out to about right up in here. Let's change this to 100. You can actually do 50 or 100, it doesn't really matter. Either one of them would give you the same result. Okay, so now whenever you run it, it looks like that. Just a really cool effect to add to your project. I mean, it ain't nothing huge, but you know, animation is animation and anything that can actually make your audience go, whoa, that's pretty cool. And then if you have this actually running in a loop, it will actually be really cool. So all right, Wayne Baron here with darkfix.net. Y'all have a rocking week now. Bye-bye.